Good day. My name is Dwayne Moloch of Moloch Science Music, and welcome to Ready, Set, Flip. For the next 12 to 15 minutes, I want to give you a basic introduction on how to flip your classroom. In the past, and currently in our classrooms, we teach in more of a teacher-centered format, meaning that we begin our units with an essential question, followed by a lecture, and eventually the students will get into small groups of some sort and eventually have an assessment. We want to move more toward a student-centered classroom where the students could re read their essential question on their own at home and also listen to and watch their lecture at home. This would allow the teacher to have so much time in school for practice and eventual assessment in school or at home. We are now going to take a deeper look at three different learning formats. We're going to explore full online learning, the blended model of learning, and the flipped model of learning. As teachers, we all have access to our Moodle pages. I want to take us through how to explore our Moodle page for the next few minutes. We begin by logging in. Once we log into our page, you will be able to see how many assignments that the students have submitted to you. You see your name so you know it's your page. You can log out. You could take a look at all the different courses that you have available to yourself. As an instructor with E. Marion, I'm, each, I'm instructing first, second, and third grade language arts, first, second, and third grade social studies. That will be my regular Greenway teacher page. And this is a 18 hour course that I took where I learned how to use E. Marion. Now, I want to take a look at first grade language arts right now. And basically, this is the way the course will be set up. It will be a series of assignments, of URLs, separated by units. You can use pictures to decorate it to make it a little more exciting for the students to look at. With your directions, video links, and assignments that can be submitted. This is the full online version, so everything will be done from this page, from learning how to use the assignments to submitting the assignments and the lectures and the essential questions are all located on the page. The only time we see the students for E. Marion is when they come in for Ames Web and if there are tutoring issues that we need to take care of. So now I'm getting ready to click on a assignment. And some assignments would open up directly as web pages and some would be downloaded to the student's computer. So this is an example of something that's downloaded that's eventually going to pop up using the computer. At home, I use a Mac Mini, so that's why it looks a little bit different. It doesn't matter if you use a Mac or PC when you create your assignments for students. And you can also see that this comes directly from the Wonder series. So when you're flipping your classroom, you can use any school materials that we have, from Wonders to Go Math to your school's choice of the science and social studies books and programs. We just finished looking at the full online version of Flip Teaching that I use as an e Marion instructor. I now want us to take a look at the blended model. We are right now we are looking at my Greenway Elementary page. 
when I log into my page, it will still show the assignments that students have submitted. And it's set up a lot like a Moodle page, except you can see that the colors are different since our school colors at Greenway are green. So what you're looking at is a current assignment that my students have to turn in before spring break. It's a simple assignment. Basically, the students have an essential question. What is a folktale? They have two short videos to watch. And then they will be doing some comparison writing between the two videos. The first video coming up right now is a video on John Henry. And I'm using a URL right from YouTube, which is what we're going to do in our sample lesson today when we begin to play with our teacher websites here in a few minutes. And it's just a short educational video that's appropriate for what I'm trying to teach from YouTube. And my second video that's going to come up is going to be on Paul Bunyan. When starting out using the blended model, you want your assignment to be something that the students are really excited to access. So from the, I take about a few minutes in class to explain what the assignment's going to be. And generally the students are very excited about completing these assignments because it feels like they're doing something that's really using technology. So this would be a 17 minute video. And it also saves me a ton of time in school. These would have to be separate days in school where it, could have to, it would have to be one day for John Henry, another day for Paul Bunyan. But now since it's online, the students can complete it at their own pace. And we're going to go through the steps of what it takes for you to flip your first assignment. 